Happy birthday, babe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, also, I have to tell you that for your birthday, we're gonna go tarantula hunting. Are you cool with that? Are you guys ready to go tarantula hunting? Yes! The annual Brooks Family Tarantula Hunting Adventure yeah. is upon us. So this right here, this right here is all the water bottles that it requires to take a family on a three-hour trip. It's a lot of water bottles, huh? Yep. Yep. We ran out of containers for the tarantulas, so I'm improvising and making one. That way the filthy things can breathe. Ah. Uh. Are you guys ready to go tarantula hunting? Yes! Okay, that was kind of weak. We go tarantula hunting every single year. We've been doing it, I think this is five years? This is our fifth. This is our fifth year. The reason why we go tarantula hunting, we never would have. It was a long, long time ago when that one back there was really shy in school. I don't remember what happened, but Mrs. basically, Maxwell. we took Brooklyn tarantula hunting. She brought said tarantula to her classroom. It helped her, so a tarantula, although horrible, can help you. Natalia has what's called arachnophobia. Pretty much. Well, I do too. I brought gloves and a gun though, so I think we'll be okay. <laughs> Far over the misty mountains cold To dungeons deep and caverns old We must away First interesting find of the trip, we found a, what appears to either be a dog or a deer. It's kind of interesting. You don't want to go look at it? Nope. No, we can. This Well, I don't think we can, actually. It makes me nervous, like, what if there's, like, poison or something? Peligro. Let's go to this abandoned house. I think we would get all stickery is the problem. Can I drown it real quick? Yeah. I've driven past this building so many times, and I've always wondered what it is. It led me down a rabbit hole this year as I was trying to find some information about it. Unfortunately, I couldn't find any information about this particular building, but I think it has something to do with the dredging that was done on the Merced River. The gold rush happened in California in 1948, and shortly after, in 1949, gold was found on the Merced River. A mining camp was established in Snelling shortly after that, in 1850. At first, panning and sluicing were used to find gold. And then a little bit after that, hydraulic mining was used. And then the big one, dredging, which was the most common, was started in 1907 and went all the way to 1952. You've probably seen the big rocks on the left and right sides of the river that are still there today. Dredging accounted for about $17 million of gold that was pulled out of the Merced River. And today you can still find gold on the Merced River, although you're not allowed to use any motorized equipment to find it. It's always interesting to me to think about all the excitement and all the activity that happened around gold on the Merced River. And now today, it's mostly gone. But there's a lot of stories there, and there's a lot of things that I still wonder about. Where is it? No juveniles. Oh, yeah, first right tarantula, there. first tarantula spotted dad. Me being dad, dad tarant Where? spotted. I can't talk, I'm Sorry, so excited. That's so gross! What are you doing? I want to see, what do you look? Oh, he's a big one. Yeah, there's too many cars though, you guys. Babe, he's a big one. Do you want to get it? Yeah! All right, so we passed on the first tarantula, which is kind of sad because he was a big old honker, but he's on a super Dad's busy. Fault. Hey, he was on a busy part of the road. I didn't want to die. I didn't want you guys to get dead. Look, oh, check out this car. Check out the beard on that guy. That's a sweet beard. All right, we found another tarantula on the road it's around a corner so can't do the whole family but he was a big one, so we got to grab him right brickery mm -hmm. oh, he's right there. Oh. oh my this thing is huge Oh, he's huge! Alright, I need someone to hold this. No, no, in the back, okay. He's not St. Catherine, is this the cemetery? Check 
Check out the old church, you guys, with the cemetery. Established 1860s. What does it For to say? me, life is Christ and death gain. I agree. There's this one which has to be super old. Every year when we go tarantula hunting, we stop at this little tiny town called Hornitos. Hornitos became a part of the United States in 1848 after the end of the Mexican-American War. It was mostly settled by Mexicans, but in 1850, there were about 10,000 people because of the gold rush. Today, there's only about 50 people, but as I go through the town, I can't help but think of all the stories that are there. One of the interesting people who got their start in Hornitos was Domingo Ghirardelli. Ghirardelli got his start by selling chocolate to the miners and soon moved his thriving business to San Francisco where it still thrives today. This is tarantula number two. Mm -hmm. Female tarantulas live up 25 years and the males live only seven or eight. And tarantulas go from just several inches to find a mate. Four miles. Four miles? Four miles? Four miles to the And if they hang out too long after you know, she'll eat them. She'll eat them. All right, so now we're gonna go walk. Well, you already had one. And look for a taranchi. We saw something dead out there. So one of the benefits of having a drone is that you can see what it is. Just checking to make sure it's on a dead purse. And... Looks like a dead moo. <laughs> It's a half-eaten moo. Is it a calf? Let me see. Half-eaten calf. Can I moo. see? That's a calf. Um, let me see. Wow. Let me see. <laughs> wow. Ooh. What are those? Little web spiders. Mm. Here's one so we can throw this as far as I can. <sighs> girls and boys walk different because girls put this for first, oh, yes. and boys put this put first. Tarantula update, we still have only got two in our possession. We decided to walk on this dirt road, and it's been tarantula-less. Tarantula-less, that's a word now. What the heck? I told you not to freaking do that! I'm done, huh? I'm done. Where is it? I can't burn the car. I'm not getting back in the car. Is it on me? Is it on me? Oh my god. Where is it? In all our years of doing this, this is the first time one has escaped. I'm not doing it. How'd it happen? I don't know. I just saw it out. Oh, you did see it? Are you going to catch it? Yeah. Where is he? Right there. It better not be in my seat. Oh my goodness. It's in the middle. Oh, that's... Hurry up. Hurry up. <laughs> What? Let it go. That's horrifying. <laughs> Paris is just like, oh, Did she get it? Paris is just like, I'll go in a crevice. Did you get it? Yeah. Get that all off. I don't want to do it. She's I'm having a panic attack. She's actually trying to do it. All right, those are secure. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Brooklyn, you are holding both of them. Do not. Never again. No, We're done. The this is the final. Right there. This is the final year, guys. I have a feeling that is not true. Yep, I know which one's mine. Oh my goodness! Look at this one. Oh no, I don't need you. I need this one. I need this Did one. Find a hole? Whoa, what's oh, he doing? He is. What is it doing? I don't know. Get him. I mom. No, get no, get it away from me! Get in there. See, this is a good time, right when the sun's about to go down. This yeah. is when we see the pigs, the coyotes, everything, and, really? the, and the tarantulas. So, I'm the nice. property manager around here. There's Sweet. a dead cow over there. It's like half eaten. Yeah, it's river. a calf. A calf? Yeah. Oh, that, it's terrible. I know because either the, the coyotes or the pigs get them, and it's just the terrible. Pigs? Really? Anything. I mean, they just, it's awful. Huh. So, especially the coyotes. Man. Yeah, I just want to make sure you guys are good. Everyone's no, no, good. the check spiders in. got yeah. loose in the car, and I about died. Little... All right, Peace cool. Guys. Thanks, man. Have a nice yeah, evening. Well, that's pretty much the end of tarantula hunting 2022. Guys, does anybody need to use the bathroom? Alright, 
so side note, we had to bring the tarantula inside because it's in the case that... Thank you. We had to bring the tarantula inside because uh, it can get out and we don't take, want it to get out in the car, so we have an actual live tarantula in the restaurant. Do tarantulas like Mexican food? Hey, hey.